Hi guys, welcome to DK Deft and today I'll be doing another unboxing. Uh, I got this uh, little device which is RCT PC stick. So I'll be just doing an unboxing, not a full review. So I won't go into details as to how it works, but I will leave a link on the description below to actually check how it actually works and where you can get it and everything. So I'm just going to unbox it for you, show you the content and I'll show you a little bit of how it works. But if you want to see like a full review, uh, of this device being connected and activated, uh, you can check the link on the description below. So yeah, let me go ahead and unbox this uh, little product, which is the uh, RCT PC Stick SO1. I'm not sure what SO1 stands for. Uh, maybe it's a model or, or whatever. I'm not sure. And then on this side, you have it shows you yeah uh, what it has inside. So it's a quad core Intel Atom processor. It has Intel HD graphics, and then it has Intel HD audio. Uh, and then this side just show you that you can transform any HDMI monitor into or a TV into a computer and then this side uh, what we have here is just the uh, processor that's running Intel inside as well as the serial number and then on the other side it shows you the spec so this one has a CPU which is 3735F I'm just not sure what kind of processor is that but I believe it's, it's the Atom quad core that they show on the other side and then the memory it's two gig memory and it has a 32 gig uh internal storage and then on the other side right here you can see which shows that it's running windows so it's a windows version and i believe it's also available in android i'm just not sure on the linux version if they have one and this one it shows that it was made by retron i'm not, I'm not sure if rct stands for retron or something yeah which means I believe there's a different version of this device somewhere. So probably Rectron just got it and branded it to their name. I don't know. And Rectron is available in where is it? Rectron again. in South Africa, uh, in Johannesburg, Midrand, and that's their website and their uh, contact details. So yeah, let me just go ahead and you can see, guys, this is like a really approved product. As you can see, there's a Icasa stick over there. So yeah, this is a, a genuine product. So let me go ahead and unbox it for you so yeah let's see what's in there okay i believe this is the stick itself just gonna put it aside for now and let's see right here. Uh, this is this product specifications as, as you can see yeah i'm not gonna go through this but as you can see the information the product spec and you can see the content what's inside the box and then there are also remarks uh, at the bottom and then this side it shows you the instruction as to as well as the content of the box so yeah yes yeah, so i'm not gonna go much into this uh the other thing is uh what's this 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 the oh this is just the conveyor so if you wanna Oh yeah, so this is a micro USB and then this is uh, all the female parts where the USB plugs in here um, which means you can get like a, a hub that you can plug it in here and then you can plug other USB devices on it. Uh, that's it with this one and then this is the, the, so the HDMI cable. So instead of plugging the, that device directly to the TV you can connect it to this device let me just take it out from there so you can connect to this because this is the female port same exact as your, your tv or your hdmi hdmi monitor so this is how it looks on the other side and then this side it's it's the male so let me just open it up for you there that's it so yeah i'm gonna check the other side and then the next thing is the uh, cable. This one, uh, it's I believe it's a it's a charging cable that you plug it to the to the power, or you can plug it to the to the TV or another uh, uh, another USB uh, port device that it can draw power from, which goes into this. This is the the power adapter, as you can see. So yeah, so this cable goes in here just to show you yeah it goes in there and then you plug it on there so yeah i'm not gonna go through these cables now but i just want to show you the device itself so this is how it looks 
Bentar si Ci. Oke itu. Oke. The cover. So it is HDMI, but that looks same exact as this one over here. So if you look at these two things, they are just the same. There you go. There you go. Yeah. And then uh, on the side, this side, you have the serial number as well as the uh, SD card slot and then where you can put your uh, your micro SD I'm not sure up to what uh, size or capacity but I believe it should be unlimited 32, 64, whatever is available in the market you can put it in there because this is a full PC so it should be able to handle any capacity and then there is a micro USB port where this port goes in so let me show you So yeah, so that port, that cable goes into this port, and then on this side, you can plug it to the, um, you can plug another USB port, or you can get a hub where you can plug multiple devices on it, and yeah, and then this side it's the, let's see, USB port. Uh, this one it's where you can plug your, and uh, I would prefer if, uh, or I'll advise you to use the, uh, what's this? A wireless uh, USB uh, keyboard and mouse, which means they will use one receiver that you can plug it in here, and then um, they will share one receiver, so which means one port is taken, or else you can use the other one on this side and then you plug it on that uh, exten extension over there. And then the other port here is the power, so which means that cable that I showed you uh, lastly it goes in here and then it goes to the uh to the to the wall and then draw power from there so this device is not self-powered it needs external powers and doesn't draw power from your monitor or your tv you still need to to power it up and this is the power button so yeah if you want to see how this device work uh check the link on the description below and you'll actually see how it works and this thing uh it is built-in speakers also but however you can use uh the, if you connect it to your, to your tv by hdmi definitely the speakers there so you can draw power from your tv to your to your sound bar or whatever device you're using to play sound from or from the tv speakers themselves but this device itself it has built-in speakers in case you plugged it to uh hdmi monitor or any monitor that doesn't have um uh, speakers so you can you can use the built-in speakers so yeah this is a cool device guys let me know what you think and if you want to know where you can buy it and how much it's for i have left the link on the description below you can just click in there and order it for yourself i hope you guys enjoyed this one and i will see you on the next one thank you guys